destroy, be frustrated right now in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and thank Him. Clap your hand and give Him praise. Clap your hand and thank Him. Give Him praise. Give Him praise. Pray, 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 pray. Advice here, how can you take advice when you are there? Amen. 
If you fail to be corrected when I'm here to correct you, when you go there, do you think you can be corrected? The battle is not easy the way you see it. Amen. 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 It's just like when one wants to go to Kenya. I said to him, can you go to Kenya? He said, yes. I said, go and take the flight. You can only take it 40,000. I said, I said, how will you get the money? He said, God will provide. I said, so if God give you 40,000 now, you give me the airline. How much are they going to give you there? You are going to preach. He said, I don't know. I said, the Bible says, count the cost before you start building a house. Amen. 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 Many of us have wasted the money God gives to us to establish ourselves. Some of us waste it in makeup, some of us waste it in human hair, Brazilian hair, Indian hair. Some of us waste it different ways. But I pray that the Lord God Almighty give us wisdom. Amen. Because God told me that we are going to be in nine Caribbean islands. And nine people here will go there and do the job. Amen. Sometimes it's not funny. But I don't know any person there. Do I know somebody here if I come? No. Haven't I know you? <laughs> my relations are not there. That woman. Do I know my relations here if I come? But how am I going to take care of myself? That is what I'm teaching you. How to take care of yourself. How to do expenses. How to cut your coat according to your size. Amen. You know your suit. If you don't cut it according to your size, when you wear it, people will know that it's not yours. You borrowed it. I pray that God will give us divine rest. Amen. Can I hear someone say better? Amen. Amen. The voice of God is a voice of divine rest. Write it down. The voice of God is the voice of divine rest. I want to give you a Bible passage that will help your life in the book of Jeremiah chapter 6, verse number 14. Jeremiah 6, 14. Jeremiah 6.14 Jeremiah 6.14 As I said, the voice of God is a voice of divine rest. We all need to stand in the place of divine rest. God will never allow anything to happen to us. He will change our destiny and our situation. Have many persons see that Jeremiah chapter 6 verse 14? What did he say, anybody? They have feared also the hurt of the daughter of my people's life. Mm -hmm. Saying, peace, peace, when there is no peace. Read it again. They Let me give you a mic. Let them. Amen. This one is not talking. They have healed also the hurt of the daughter of uh -huh. my people's life. They have healed also the hurt of the daughters of my people slightly. Say it. Peace, peace, where there is no peace. You cannot have peace where there is no peace. I pray that the voice of God give you peace this week. Amen. When you don't say anything to what I say, to what I say will pass you. Let me tell you something. If this is a prophetic ministry. If I say you will succeed and you do your head like this, it will not come to pass. A closed mouth is a closed destiny. So when I say you will succeed, you need to open amen, your mouth amen, and shout. Amen, amen. Can I hear better amen to that? Amen. So there are things that is threatening daughters and sons of this land. And those things threatening you will never let you go until God speaks peace to you. Amen. That is why you see Jesus when there is threat in the sea. The disciples were crying and shaking. They were disciples. They were born again. They were all baptized. But there are things that terrify born again people. There are forces that terrify born again people. There are demons that don't fear you being born again. There are demons that don't care whether your pastor is a prophet or a deacon. There are demons that don't care. I'm telling you something here. I know, I know. They were all born again. They were all Christians. They were all preachers of the gospel. They do cast out demons. So don't be happy that you cast out demons and you think that demons cannot attack you. Many of us were busy casting demons and hearing from God. But somebody just says something and that is it. You take break from coming to church for two weeks. Who do you think you are deceiving? That is to say that there is no peace in you. 
You know the hymns in the Bible, but you don't know him. That have the hymns. Amen. Do you understand that? You know the whole hymn. You can read the hymn, him. all the hymns, you can sing it, but you don't know him. That have the hymn. I want to talk to somebody here. The disciples were busy preaching. But there is something that terrified them. They never understand it at all. The Bible says the sea, the wind come against them. Many of us, there are some time we have waves of bacana, waves of trouble. The enemy, the worst thing that can happen to you is for you to join us here and be binding and casting and binding and casting. And suddenly somebody just says something, you take a break. The whole demon you bind it will come and deal with you. It's better you don't bind it. You just stay. I, I, I will say it again. I want to say it again. The worst thing that can happen to you is for you to join us. Fire! Fire! Burn! Holy Ghost! You finish shouting this. And suddenly somebody just says, you take a break. Say, I don't want to go there. Those people are nasty. And you take a break. The demon will say, thank you. Thank you. Oh Lord, thank you, Jesus. This one have just walked into our territory. Yeah. They will deal with you within six months. You will see yourself. You will not recognize yourself. Go and ask all the people that left the church. By Bacana. You, their life is useless. And it's not for anything. Because you have attacked the kingdom of darkness. And they will come back. That is why you need the voice of peace. When somebody is talking against you, that voice will tell you relax. That voice will tell you relax. This too will pass. Yes, 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 yes. Am I telling somebody here? Yes, yes, yes. That voice, that is why they call him the Prince of Peace. Yes. If the Prince of Peace is not in you, the Prince of Peace is with peace in your life. Many of us have left Prince of Peace, and the Prince of Peace is inside. And that is why every little ch -ch -ch is in your head. My head full. I want to relax. No problem, relax. Relax. Relax until the whole demon you fight will come and relax with you. When you come back, your condition will be worse than when you left us. I feel like talking to somebody here. Can I hear someone say, talk to me now?